Hey tubes. I'm here with a uh excavator um pack here. And um it's not too bad of a pack. I've tried out all the attachments. And uh as you can hear this this baby starting up right here. So what we are going to do in this episode is um we're going to go ahead and uh show you, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and show you all the different functions of this uh pack so this is the same as those other two excavators over there they're just two different colors and um so first we've got a uh we've got a little silage or manure um grabber here everyone you feel like and uh so it folds all the way out like that and all the way in like that and stuff pretty good and um up down over over up up you know all that other good stuff um so this is silage and uh, manure as i remember so i'm gonna stop that right there that was a little bit weird Now we have a little uh, bucket which does um, salad also. Um, it does, uh, yeah, salad and manure because it's one of those uh, not universal, but it's um, multi-purpose. And um, maybe I'll bring all this stuff down and show you guys all the all the different stuff just to prove it to you, but it's just I feel like it, I don't know if I feel like it today. So, um, here's your log port. These will be very handy machines for you. It's $12,000 for each one of these machines, and it is also $900, Euro, or $900 for, um, for all of these, uh, attachments for it. Alright, so now we have a, uh, a little um, thing that will attach for your uh, for your like your forklift attachments here. Alright, we're gonna pick that up. We're gonna bend our I'm not used to this yet, I'm sorry. <laughs> bend our uh, thing in here. And a little bit more. So how do I rotate? You can't rotate on this? Nope, nope, you can. I'm going to tackle my support feet down. There you go. Alright, so there we go. This is the... Why don't you go up? Oh yeah, so you don't call for anything more. So this is the bail grabber here. Um... This is not the best if you are trying to grab high bales, but it'll do the job, I guess. Um, and I gotta switch attachments here for this thing to work. Just kidding. Alright, are you gonna... How do I open and close this thing here? Spinning it. Numpad zero does what? Let's see. Oh, um, I don't keep trimming. That's not too helpful. Um. Oh, you know what? This might have an interactive tab here. Um. Nope. Never mind. I don't think it does. You can see the crone attachment there, uh, spazzing out. There's a nice little view. 
Alright, so up, down, over, over. Okay, let's go left. Oh, here we go. Alright, so you gotta go right and uh, over, you know, to the right or left. Right to close it and left to open it. Okay, that's just awesome. That's a nice camera angle. Okay, so, uh, here we go. It's all the attachments that comes with it. But I am going to try to, uh, try to attach. Um, I'm going to try to attach a different forklift mount, or a different forklift attachment, just to see if it'll work. See if I can get this thing to... Uh-oh, that's not the right thing. I didn't want it to get stuck on there, buddy. Alright, I need to hack. Now, how do I get rid of... No, oh, that's the whole thing. I don't want to get rid of the whole thing. No! I want to just get rid of the... Oh! Okay, okay, I see, I see. Nope, just kidding. Nope, just kidding. Uh oh. Alright, um, I'm gonna try G again. There we go. There goes that piece. Put up a mount so we can move. Quickly. Yeah, I, I don't like it how quick it is to move. It's too nimble for old things, and uh, also even the newest ones don't even move that fast. Newest excavators. So that was weird. Really kind of just out the whole thing, right? And, oh, wrong way. Oops, sorry, buddy. That's okay though, because we can just pick it up, drive over this way, and then rotate it through like a boss. It's awesome. Yay! So it does work with other forklift attachments, if it'll get loose there. Yeah, so it does work with, um, it does work with forklift attachments, which is great, just any, any forklift attachment, that's even a mod, so, uh, it won't, it'll for sure work with in-game, if it works with a mod. Alright, and, uh, how do I tilt it? I can't tilt it, really? I can only do that, and then my support links up and down. Yeah, I, I can't tilt the, uh, yeah, I can't tilt the, 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 uh, little bail fork that we have on there, though, so that's a problem. It's probably not going to work out too well for us here. Um, it'll still rotate, which is good, I guess. Yeah, it'll still rotate, but it won't work <laughs> if you're trying to pick up bales with this thing. Other than that bale grabber over there, which will for sure work. So, um, yeah, I think that is about it for, uh, for this mod here. And there uh, was that little bale for it. What else is there? Let's see if we can attach to a huge uh, loader bucket here. And then after that, I'm going to show you the details of this uh, excavator here. Um, nope, not going to attach. Okay, well, uh, I'll just show you the details. So, uh, it's got an actual, actually pretty, uh, 
pretty um, exaggerated engine there. Pretty nice looking. Um, light work. And, uh, yeah, it's kind of old, so there's not too many features on this thing. I'm just going to turn this off. And, uh, put on the handbrake. And that is it. So, uh, expect more mod spotlights, because, uh, I have some more mods here. And, um, yeah, that's, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Um, the link for these will be below. And, um, suggest any other ones and comment for, uh, for any mods that you want me to find for you. And, uh, just anything. Just comment and I'll be there for you. So, uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. And, uh, I'll see you guys later.